Hey guys, so welcome to Judgment. I haven't played any games in so long. Okay, it's been like over a month. It's been, it feels like forever. And, okay. Uh, so I wanted to play Judgment. It's a game and it's made by Yakuza creator. So it's kind of really similar to the Yakuza games. And, okay. Let's start the game. Okay, here we go. Let me just turn on the subtitles. Oh, they are on. And um, one sec. Subtitle display. Ah, uh, I turned something on. Oh yeah, like this. Okay. Okay, now. And uh, normal. Okay. Yes. Yes, I understand completely. We'll absolutely be able to help you out with that. I guarantee you. Oh, you must be talking about Yagami. Absolutely. We appreciate any interest you might have. But Where the hell just, are... Uh, their hair glowing like this. Wow. You know, must be so nice to be a rock star. Right, Salary Chan? This would look Do nice not, if Sarah's their speaking. hair wasn't glowing yes. so weirdly. Yagami is currently employed by our firm. Same bullshit all day. Guess everyone wants a lawyer who can win, huh? Yagami Sensei. Hey, throw me a bone. I never would have won without a hand from these two. Of course you wouldn't have. 99% of these cases end up in convictions. It makes an acquittal a big deal. Even if it was just luck. Talk about a lawyer being a hero. Makes even a former gangster look good. I <laughs> guess so. Wipe that grin off your face. You think you're better than us? I'm no saint. Shh. Could have fooled me. You know, you're not gonna win all of them. Trust me, pal. My record's not... Are you listening? Of course. I get the message. Hmm. Well, Shintani's available right now. Yeah, you bet. He's more experienced. Are you hearing that? No, no. Now I'm getting I, tossed your goddamn leftovers. Like he does <sighs> work. Shut up, man. Okay, guys, just one okay. quick thing. And I've noticed sure? that, you know, about the hair glowing me. that I mentioned. But no, I can only no. see it on my TV he and not on cases. on my laptop. Uh, no, not the recorded game that I can see right now. Okay, not gonna interrupt anymore. Sorry. Behind bars, pretty ridiculous, huh? right? What? Well, you still want Yagami, though? Man, I am so done. Hey, can it? Yes. Yes. And you're absolutely sure. I understand. I'll tell him. Who was that? Another call for Yagami-sensei. Big whoop. 
But the client is Shinpei Okubo. Mm. Huh? Not sure I believe that. Okubo is a free man now. Not anymore. He's been arrested for murder. Come on. We already proved he was innocent, right? It's a new case. He's being processed right now. What they told me is that he stabbed his girlfriend Emmy to death, set the apartment on fire. Okubo would never do that. <sighs> Stabbing Emmy John. I just don't understand it. Okubo. That day, my career as a lawyer died alongside Emi-chan. We're gonna play? Oh, this looks awesome. I love Japanese games, okay, so much. Oh, there he is. Come in, Kaito-san. Are you getting close yet? Yep. Right by the Don Quixote. Heading your way now. You just about see our man? Mm-hmm. Not even gonna try to pronounce the names. Yep, I got him. He doesn't have a clue, huh? Because I don't want to... You know, uh, you're getting good at this. Pronounce Almost it like wrong. <laughs> wow, thanks. I always dreamed of being a professional stalker. <laughs> Not sure I'd call it that. You gotta admit, this is crazy, though. A detective tailing another detective? You only see that shit on TV. Crazy or not, stay focused. I'm gonna play. All right, I'll join up with you soon. Okay. <laughs> Step aside, old man. Piece of goddamn <laughs> trash. The asshole, he said no. Come on, not these again. So many of these in Yakuza, are so annoying. Just mind your own business. What? Are you doing? what? Now, do you want to die, bitch? The hell is his problem? <sighs> What's going on back there, buddy? Uh, looks like I need to teach these punks a little lesson. Need to? Didn't you tell me to keep my head down? Hey, who you call punks, you homeless piece of shit? Huh? Let Sorry, me punch Kato. you. I'll see you soon, okay? So much for being careful. Let's go. <laughs> Get a load of him. Man, you seeing this shit? What kind of sweater is that? <laughs> okay, our boy's a movie star. Yeah, that sweater. The guy on the li on the right. <laughs> You're a damn joke. No, let's, let's get this let's over. This Come on. And finally. Just gonna click random bottoms. Wow. Wow. Uh, L1. Okay, L1. Got it? They are punching me, so I don't need to block them. Yeah! Yeah! 
Oh, no. Okay, sorry. Yes! Whoa! About a little health. Stop cheering. Come on, just die already. Yeah. Come on, just die already. Okay. That's it. No. Woo! Surprise, bitch! I was secretly hot all the time. But wait, did he have a beard? How did he get rid of the beard? On his way towards Pink Street. Crowd's thinning out. Get your ass over here. Got it. And make it quick. Any minute now, he's gonna figure out I'm shadowing him. Okay, just gotta ask again. How did he get rid of the beard? Um, mm hmm. Uh, huh? Ping something. Ta -da! Ah, sorry. I'm all moving to sprint. It's this way. This is Yakuza. Don't tell me otherwise. Oh, really? I need more time. Well, that's just rude. Oh, sorry. Um, like this. I already forgot how he looked like. Uh, tailing search mode. Okay. Oh. He had like a like a cap. Is that him? What the? Yeah, that's him. Ah, on first try. Found him. Thought you were never gonna catch up, man. Sorry. Sorry. But I can't move. Stop. Yeah, yeah.
I'm just gonna turn around, turn around. No. time you pay all the rent you owe. I just need a little longer, okay? Just one more week. <sighs> Another week? I am done warning you. Yes, I assure you. It better be. Bye for now, then. Bye! Oh, that was close. Ah, someone call me? Oopsie. What? Oopsie. The dude. Okay, okay, okay. He's over there. Calm down. doing I can't blend in anywhere huh someone call Yikes. no he's coming back Paranoid. Ah, oh, damn it. There he is, there he is, there he is. See him. Dude, where are you going? Kaito san. He's heading for the champion district. Oh, great. We're never going to find him in that maze. Probably why he's going there. Thankfully, we can always follow him from above. Yeah? Wanna break out the pigeon? Just try to head him off, Kaito-san. And be ready. On it. Oh, and try not to get carried away. Can't afford to get that thing fixed again. Yeah, yeah. Just don't lose him. Now what? He just ducked into an empty lot, Kaito-san. Dead end. 
We follow him, we blow our cover. What do you think he's doing in there? Probably meeting someone he doesn't want to be seen with. Makes sense. Pigeons up. Can you see it? Hold on. The drone? Hmm. Yeah, drone. Suspicious. Aha, uh -huh, look at your drone. Wait up. Um There you are. What the There it is. Big pot. I'll send the feed to your phone. Nice flying, Kaito-san. Keep steady. You been practicing? Now is not a good time, talk. Gotta concentrate. Hmm. There's another guy in there with him. So he is meeting someone. Is it the lawyer hey, guy? guy? It's a bookie for horse races. Oh no. Trying to gamble his way to paying off debts, huh? Because that always works. Yeah, well, if they came all the way out here just to meet. He must have the cash on him. Mm -hmm. We'll get what we need if we move now. You remember what we're doing here, right? Collecting the debt that detective owns. Oh, I get it. This is our chance. Just relax. Let me do my thing, okay? You got it, Talk. Don't fuck it up. Ah, should I? Yeah, yeah, okay. Hello? What you doing here? Nice night, huh, detective? Huh? I hear the bookies in Kamurocho make some pretty good deals. You win 10% more, you lose 10% less. They make it sound so enticing. Maybe I should get in on it. Hey, where are you going? Don't you need your money? What the hell is this? Who are you? I'm here to get my client's money back. Before you lose it on another horse. So they hired a thug to collect. Should I be impressed you found me? A thug? Well, that's not very nice. You and I are in the same business. You're... a detective? Afraid so. I hear you're pretty hard to get a hold of. That's why the people you owe came to me. Look, I know you have the money on you. You can't get out of this. Just do us both a favor and pay up. Don't put up a fight. <laughs> well, you're right. I have the money. But look, I'll pay everything back after I win big on this next race. Just wait, okay? Are you serious? I didn't track uh -oh. you down just so you could... Maybe next time! Whoa! Oh, you gotta be kidding me. Kaito-san, he's making a run for it. I saw. Where are you going, oh, I was guy? gonna fight him. Damn it. Get back here. I lost him. Hold up. No. <laughs> Dude. Am I going the right way? I think he went here. Yeah. You won't get away. Woo! This is fun. Almost got you, baby girl. Okay. Gotcha. Uh. 
Fuck off! You need to learn when to quit. Shut up. I have it all figured out. I'll get the money! First player detective. No. Yeah. Yeah, in the face. Didn't you say you were a detective? What's your name? I never said I'd field any questions, asshole. <sighs> it's Yagami. Take a good look. Now do you believe me? <sighs> so, let's be civil here. Just hand over the cash, okay? 150 grand sound good? Back the fuck off. You running some kind of racket here? I'll sue you. Oh, yeah? Huh? You gonna sue? The fuck do you think you are? Huh? Uh, hold on, Kaito-san. The hell? You're not a detective asshole, you're fucking Yakuza. Oh, yeah? Guess you know what'll happen if you don't pay up there. <laughs> Hey, ease up, Kaito-san. I'm sure he doesn't want to piss you off anymore. I said all right! Listen here, asshole. I'm gonna sue your ass into the goddamn ground. You see this? You broke my fucking nose. <laughs> Don't be so melodramatic. I think we both know who threw the first punch. No, no way I'm gonna let that slide. Just you watch, you'll see the court's gonna... Huh? But that's... A lawyer's badge. So you're not a detective. And? You still wanna sue? You know, you won't know what hit you.
Comrocho. No better place for a night out. A neon city. But the brighter the lights, the darker the shadows. The whole town's run by the toughest Yakuza family out there. The Tojo clan. And the deeper you dig, the more interesting things get. More dangerous, too. Take this burglary ring. Just a bunch of kids looking for kicks. Word is, they met on some sketchy website. Never even seen each other's faces. As for the cops, they can't catch a single one. The only thing anyone really cares about in Kamurocho these days, though, is the murders. Over three months, three Kansai Yakuza have turned up dead. Most think it's the Tojo clan, making some kind of power move in the ongoing turf war. <clears throat> this one's missing its eyes, too. <clears throat> That's not the only thing, though. All three of them were missing their eyes. It's in one little corner of this city that I run a detective agency. I work alongside my partner, Kaito-san. Funny enough, he's ex-Tojo. And me? I'm Takayuki Yagami. Used to be a lawyer, but I put that life behind me three years ago. As for my badge, it's barely even a decoration at this point. Here. I'll scrounge up the rest for you later. What about your cut? I'll get it eventually. All of this goes to the client. Gotcha. Anyway, I'm gonna swing by Genda Sensei's place. See if he's got any work. Don't hold your breath. For a lawyer's office, things are slow as shit over there. Uh, you're aware they're one of our best clients, right? Yeah, yeah, I know you used to work there and all. But don't show up empty-handed. Here, buy him some sweets or something. At least go through the motions. So generous. My boy's all grown up. Don't mention it, Dad. Now get going. Buy a gift for the office. Ah, got stuck. What a cute apartment. Let's see. That's it. Yeah. Okay. I hear they've got some extra fancy dorayaki at the Popo over on Tenkaichi Street. Even come in a box. Huh? Well, Genda Sensei's got a pretty big sweet tooth, if you get me. Right. I'll go pick some up.
ありがとうございましたおおありがとうほどんねえパウおけらう You just bought some of them Doriaki, yeah? Sorry, but they're mine now. Uh, are they? Look, I've been after one of those things for days now, and you just bought the last fucking box. Can't stand for that, right, boys? Wow. Come on, boys. Can't argue with that logic. What was that, smartass? Boys. I'm gonna do that more often. Okay, wait, wait. Okay, skills. Okay, fine. Shit without a real good reason. And that means it was you. You dumbasses jumped the wrong guy. Uh, no. Uh, you know this guy's like a son to the Matsugani patriarch, right? Uh, know what I'm trying to say? Asshole. Hey, come on, Cap. Can't we just let it be? No can do. This right here just became a matter of Matsugane family honor. I'm sorry. <laughs> Kengo, you haven't met our buddy Tuck here, have you? He's a guy you want to know. Hot shot detective type. Right. It's good to meet you. The boss paid his way through law school back in the day. Made him into a damn good attorney. Guy even managed to get a bona fide serial killer off the hook. Seriously? Wow, that's incredible. <laughs> right? Damn shame seeing talent like that go to waste. <laughs> totally! <laughs> get this, though. The first thing that killer did when he got loose? Stabbed his girlfriend to death. Can you believe that? <laughs> oh, damn. <laughs> yep. Guy got the death penalty and everything. They get around to hanging his ass, talk. Not yet, no. What the hell's taking him so long? Here. This is the money from that detective. The rest is yours. I already took my cut. Good. You're finally getting the hang of this whole debt collecting thing. Yeah, thanks to you. Hmm. <laughs> anyway, how's Kaito? Fine. You mind asking him something? How long's he gonna stick around? Not wise to stay in town after you get kicked out of the family. But, uh, I can look the other way since the boss likes you so much. Speaking of... How's Matsugane-san doing? None of your damn business, I'd say. Come on, let's go.
Hey there, sorry son. Look, Doriaki. Extra fancy. Genda Law Office, where I used to work. Things haven't changed much these past three years. Hello, Yagami-san. Oh, I didn't see you there. You, uh, getting situated? Yes. Everyone here is just great. So I hear you're good. Passed the bar with top marks and everything. <laughs> How'd you end up in this dump and not in a bigger office, huh? Huh? Well, you see, that's... Uh... I hear you over there, no. Yagami. Evening, Genda sensei Other than my real dad, there's two people I look up to like a father. Genda sensei is one of those people. He gave me a job here, before I'd even gotten out of law school. Shintani sensei out for the night? Uh, I can't keep track of that boy. I'm sure you're happy, though. You don't have to deal with him. Huh? You two can't stand each other. You hate each other's guts. Be honest with me here. Uh, hold on now. Shintani's like a mentor to me. So, about that job you have. If you really want that job, you're gonna have to get along. So show your senpai a little more respect. Oh, Genda sensei. I got you some dorayaki. Just sit right there. I'll grab you one. <clears throat> Sorry? Did you eat them all? All but half. Hope you don't mind. So, what are the chances you've got some work for me, Genda Sensei? Work, huh? How long are you gonna keep doing this to yourself, Yagami? You know how dangerous this city is. Wouldn't be many cases for me if Kamurocho was a safe place. Uh-huh. Cases like collecting debt for the Yakuza? Hey, better that than no work at all, am I right? You call that detective work? You're practically a mercenary. <laughs> Fine by me. I was never too hung up on being a detective anyway. Listen, Yagami. Yeah? You ever thought about becoming a lawyer again? I haven't. And why is that? Take a good look at me, Genda Sensei. Mm hmm? These eyes aren't exactly the best judge of character. I think I made that clear three years ago. What use am I as a lawyer if I can't tell good from bad? Knock it off, Yagami. Stop beating yourself up. What happened to Emmy was tragic, yes, but it wasn't your fault. It doesn't matter whose fault it is. I never want to deal with something like that again. So, have any work for me? A guy's got to stay busy, you know? Keeps me distracted from Emmy chan and all that. It doesn't matter what you've got, just give me something. <sighs> How about a divorce case? I have some evidence that needs collecting. It'll be the usual deal. Stake out a love hotel, snap some photos, tail the guy, dig through some trash. You in? I'm in. A job's a job. Oh, I give up. I'll send you the details later. And next time, don't bring a gift, you hear? Doesn't feel right taking them from guys too broke to pay for them. Anything you say.